is jumping in with the requests. This is like, Sarah, will you sing at my wedding October 7th, 2017? First of all, congrats. Oh, you have another request. Yeah, this is all about you. My fiance proposed by singing You Matter to Me. Aww. The answer is no. <laughs> No, that's amazing. I'm going to be on a, on a long vacation, but um, thanks. Okay, great. We're back. And we're back, everybody. Um, thank you so much for coming. Thank you for that beautiful introduction and, um, and the invitation to join you on your most intimate, beloved day. <laughs> um, Waitress has absolutely changed my life. I am so grateful to be a part of this project, and it has... Um, just, I, I was actually speaking about it today. It's been life-changing and life-saving in so many ways, and I am forever indebted to this incredible group of people who we are a small portion of ourselves today. We have um, few but mighty brought with us today, um, but we have had an amazing journey together, and um, you know, I started writing for this show about four years ago, and um, the first song that I wrote for the show um, was She Used To Be Mine. And well, I didn't know at the time that I was gonna fall so deeply in love with this whole show and it has been absolutely magical and really fucking hard. <laughs> um, I think we would all probably say the same thing. <laughs> like, it's been a, a myriad of experiences and feelings and emotions, but um, ultimately to have this is just something that I think I will never get over and never forget to have this this moment in time to celebrate this music and these incredible performers. Um, so I'm so glad you guys are here to hear selections from Waitress. I'm gonna be your MC for the afternoon. Get ready. I've planned nothing, so I didn't plan it. Okay. Um, thank you. It's one of my great talents is um, planting my own songs into <laughs> speeches. Um, uh, up first is um, a song that was rewritten between rewritten for our Broadway production between um, our out of town um, run at the ART up in Boston. Um, this song originated as a song called Door Number Three. <laughs> and when we came away from that production realizing that we weren't quite getting enough of Jenna's backstory and we weren't quite understanding exactly her relationship to her pie making and why um, her history was so involved in these recipe in these recipes so that song got sort of reimagined and it is one of the great pleasures of my life to get to uh, to have gotten to work with and get to know the incredible Jesse Mueller. Who plays Jenna. And um, has brought so much grace and so much humility and vulnerability to this, to this role. And then she opens her mouth and you're like, oh hell no. <laughs> So um, this woman has been an absolute gift to the show, and it's, uh, as have our entire cast, um, really, what an amazing group of people. But she's going to sing for you um, the reimagined door number three, which is now one of my favorite songs in the show, and it's called What Baking Can Do. Guys, right, so remember the words about the actions. <laughs>
maybe from an old man. Time's just saying slipping past. We want to hold it in our hands, but no one ever sees what falls through the cracks. Take it from an old man. have made me and I am what I am and though I don't believe in silver linings I believe there's something in you something good is trying to break through you might have to fight the good fight Take it from an old man, take it from an old man. The days don't stretch any longer. They've left tracks upon my skin, but I went on made me stronger. But I believe there's something in theater but I didn't realize that I would someday work in this capacity and I have realized how lucky we are to have an audience I mean we do all of this stuff for you they do more than I do at this point <laughs> sorry eight shows a week <laughs> good job you guys um, but we are so lucky and we're so privileged to have an audience come fill those those seats in that room every night. And um, I just, I feel so blessed and so fortunate. And so I just wanna say thank you for all the support to all of you here in the room. And for those of you watching at home, we, um, the Waitress family is very, very grateful um, to get to let this story live on. And uh, it means a lot to us. So anyway, that boring bullshit aside, <laughs> right? Let's get to the sex with the gynecologist. It's a bad idea, man, you. Yeah, totally agree. It's a bad idea, man, you. I have never known anything so true. It's a terrible idea, man, you. You have a wife. You have a husband. You are my doctor. You got a baby coming. Run it, man. 
I'll never see myself ever be anything more.